Hey, how are you? You guys up for another house rating? If you are, then let's go. Hey there, what do you say? And welcome back to my channel. Um, all right, like I said, gonna be rating every one of my juice box fragrances. Now, unlike most of the time I do this, um, I only have eight juice box fragrances so far, but every fragrance from this house that I've sniffed is an absolute banger. Anyway, let's go ahead and jump right in. All right, coming at number eight, uh, it is dead last, but trust me when I tell you, it is still an absolutely incredible fragrance and it is Beat Cafe. <laughs> All right, this is Wicked Boozy. It is a cognac bomb with spices, leather, and tobacco. All right. Number seven is Simon & Sailors. Simon & Sailors is boozy, just like the one previous to this. But uh, this is a fruit basket doused in whiskey and rum. And basically, this is a fruit-flavored liquor, uh, lightly sweetened. There you go. And in at number six is Green Bubble. This is a monster. Big, giant, massively powerful fragrance. Fantastic. It's um, it's weed. You know, marijuana, smothered in honey, grapefruit juice, and woods. It's extremely potent, like I said. Get pulled over wearing this, and the cops will be like, Okay, have you any marijuana to smoke today? Because I can smell some marijuana in the vehicle. All right. And now the fifth best from this house is 14 Hour Dream. Um, real quick, what this smells like. Uh, spices, patchouli, and saffron are the standouts here, folks. Sweetened up at the end, and you've got yourself one hell of a fragrance. Once again, 14 Hour Dream. In at number four is Golden Saffron. I said it before, and I'll say it again. This smells like a much sweeter version of Interlude Man. So freaking good. Number three, the third best is Black Powder. This is tobacco covered in fruit compote, heavy powder, and leather. Just freaking incredible. And in that number two, this one is called Cheeky Smile. All right, lots of aldehydes here, iso e super, and amber. Um, I said this before, a sweeter version of Baccarat Rouge 540. So if Baccarat Rouge 540 is a little bit too band-aidy for you, jump on this. And in at number one, numero uno is Visionary Eye. I have to tell you. Although it's true that every juice box offering that I've sniffed so far is amazing, this one is significantly better than all the rest. Literally number one with a bullet. Damn, this is good. It's a powder bomb with cinnamon, lavender, and citrus. And then at the end, it sweetens up really nicely. All right, this one left me speechless when I first sniffed it. And there you go. That's my quick video rating every single juice box in my collection. Let me know in the comment section what are your favorites from the House of Juice box. Hope you guys have a good one, all right? I'll talk to you later.